Got that crash. How is the the remake? Where did I It is very hard. Like, I feel like I do not remember how hard Crash Bandicoot was. I do distinctly remember uh, how difficult it was to catch the little blue guy in Spyro, though. Kali knows what I'm talking about. That fucking blue turban guy? Hate that guy. <laughs> She's on the same page. Cause he has so much so many valuable things, but he makes you fucking chase him around. John, I'm trying to to join your broadcast. Keep saying that the broadcast has been stopped. Uh, I'm on the air. Uh mm. let me see if I can let me get my laptop real quick. Damn. If you go, if you like, go to to John Rushing in your friend list. Uh, he should have a little camera next to his name, and you can start the stream from from there. But I am having trouble with it. I got mine going. Okay. And I can you can hear me in it. Yeah. Oh my God, I'm being broadcast, and I don't even know it. Well, I guess that's because I'm in. Come on now. Uh, I'm gonna. I'm gonna give my PlayStation 4 a little reset. I'll be right back. Okie doke. Why'd everyone leave the party? Oh, okay. Let me... Is he having a gnat issue? So how you been? I've been alright. Uh, went to the station today to train somebody, but they never showed up. Yeah, uh, let me mute this. Nah, it's fine. I had my. Uh, I was reading a book. I didn't even notice how much time had passed. That is. If Jake wanted to play, I'm going to send him a link.
Excellent. This is uh, probably the best smash since Melee. It's. Oh, I have all the characters. So we can already do that. Welcome back. Alright, let's see if I can get this shit to work. Uh, at least I might not be able to join us tonight. She's feeling like a hot sack of garbage. Oh no! She needs to lay down. It's alright. I mean, we, we kind of we, we got, went out and did our, all of our fucking Christmas shopping. It was a busy day. She had to get up at like early in the morning to do an unrelated like doctor's appointment. So. She's, uh, she's had a full day already. Aw. Uh, uh, she says, thanks, Jake. Uh, okay, let's... How do I... Yes. There we go. Okay. Let me log into the zone. Bam, 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 bam. Waiting on Sean. John, I went, John, I went to a, uh, a thrift store that specialized in uh, uh, video games today, and at an unrelated uh, thrift store that specialized in, in horror films. So you went to GameStop? Uh, I did not. I went to basically the equivalent of Planet Fun, although it was a lot uh, grosser in there than Planet Fun. It was, but it, it was it was run by somebody who clearly cares about it an awful lot. Well, that's it was, good. Uh, big old uh, Rob robot that I did try to buy, but he told me that not only was it was was it broken, but it probably would cost over three hundred dollars. So I was like, okay, never mind. Oh yikes! Learned a lot. Yeah, learned a lot about video game shit. Apparently, uh, now is a good time to uh, make fake. N64 games. Faking N64? What do you mean by that? Yeah, there's like a weird like market of fake N64 games because they were like for two years there they were super hot. Everybody Interesting. Wanted them. Like specially made games, like indie games. No, I mean like just just uh oh uh, yeah I mean specifically like counterfeits. Oh uh, okay. Twist two. Hey, are we all in here? Yeah. Uh, I think he's in the club. Yeah. So, oh. Oh. Jake, get your ass in get here. Get on in here, Jake. Uh, apparently, the next hot shit is. Uh... I mean, there are some N64 games that are still pretty darn rare. They didn't even actually have that good of a selection. I mean, I could have gotten Snowboard Kids which I'm sure Patrick would have had fun with, but uh, we did not grow up with Snowboard Kid. I didn't uh, play any of those snowboarding games. games. Everybody's going nuts. Like, so that's like the net new hotness. That's the new, like, these games are back to being full priced. Very nice. I've got some pretty rare GameCube games. Ooh. They're expensive. Imagine the Imagine the future where Wii games are the, the hot shit. I'm waiting on PS3 games, but I don't think that'll ever happen. <laughs> it might. You never know. Apparently, like, so I, I asked about specifically Clay Fighter 63 and a third for uh, Nintendo 64, which is a game that's <laughs> very nice, Jake. Uh, but, uh,. Apparently there was a blockbuster exclusive version of that that goes for like four hundred dollars because Blockbuster did this weird thing where they would just destroy shit. They would they would be like, Oh, okay, we're done with that and then <laughs> literally throw it into a fire. Oh, wow. And they could not sell. They would destroy stock.
You'll get points for each player that can correctly guess your title. So, have fun! But Jake, yes, I we played that a, an awful lot. I think Boogerman was an exclusive to the Blockbuster version of that video game, uh, <laughs> which was another property owned by the people who did Clay Fighter. I got Patrick the uh, Super Nintendo version of it for Christmas, uh, along with Secret of Mana, which Very nice. I... Uh, had not seen for a while. I hope he does not have it already. Patrick has kind of started, he's got like a little uh, uh, collection of shit going. Uh, so I'm just trying to, to add to it. He just got a Dreamcast and I was hot on the fucking case for some Dreamcast games. But uh, it, unless it's like Madden 04 or something, it's very hard to find <laughs> Dreamcast games. Because I was like, hey, you wouldn't happen to have a, a real copy of Power Stone 2, would you? And he just, he laughed at me. <laughs> That's a good game. Well, check to see which serial number he has, because depending on what it is, if it was one of the original ones, uh, then he can just burn games and play them. Yes, uh, and I know that that's how we did uh, your situation. All right, it's time to vote. Oh. Achoo, excuse me. Yes, Patrick is still in uh, New Orleans, uh, Jake. You found a photo of him. Oh, well, that's great. Next time you guys are down there, you, he's still working at the same place. The uh, Snug Harbor gave him a, 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 a promotion a little while ago. Now he's like in charge of sound over there instead of just being a sound guy, uh, which he deserves. He's been doing it for a while. And he, ba he basically owns a part. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> that's okay. Let's not be stuck for a second. Well, I know which one I want it to be. The bungle chip? <laughs> the, the, the bungle chip? <laughs> Party carrot on the run. Oh, you got fucking tricked. You got tricked. Kylie. Powerful carrots. Yeah, okay, that sounded like something that this game would... We're, we're slowly learning the language that this particular uh, game uses. Now, this one. Put in your titles now. Look at those points. Look at that point spread. Here we go. Oh god. Hmm. <laughs> the whole family is involved. Wait, do you guys have a cat now? Oh, okay. I like all of these answers.
What could it be? What could it be now? Guys, get five seconds left. Four, three, two, somebody answer. And here are your picks. It's not even the answer, it's just a vote. Mm -hmm. right, fucking got me, John. I did fucking it. Got me, me and Jake. Was it really a documentary about fences? There's not a whole lot you can do with that, Ian. You did your best. I I even voted for that because I thought it was kind of a funny answer, and uh, didn't even count it. I'm like, it couldn't possibly be that. Huh. Is someone else viewing our great stream? Our hot, drawful stream? Yeah, you know, it's all my subscribers. All the tens of millions of them. If only you could be streaming that hot Smash Brothers action, everyone could see that secret character that you've been mastering. Oh, I can if I want to. Really? Mm-hmm. I have a capture card. <laughs> <laughs> I like how this robber is holding the knife by the sharp part. <laughs> this is my knife! This bank robbery is carbon neutral. Oh, and here are your picks. <laughs> oh, we fucking got got again. I even purposefully tried to name mine something. Yeah, mine was really bland. And okay, I got you, John. Uh, Jake says, Sean, do you remember that super racist Chinese character you could play on Clay Fighter? He had moves like, oh yes, <laughs> Mugu Guy Pan and Poo Poo Platter. Yep. That was the whole thing. I wonder why that company didn't continue to do well in the video games market. And why Clay Fighter was not a venerated, uh, a clay, well, a, a fighting game in general. But I think we all know why. Because Taffy was not as big a character as they wanted him to be. I thought the, the main character in that was a snowman. Well, that was the character that was on the front. That's a weird choice, come to think of it, because that kind of makes it seem like a Christmas game. Although, I believe Santa was also in the game as a playable character. I think he was too. Clay <laughs> Fighter 53 and a third? A Christmas game? No, it had Ichabon Crane, the pumpkin head dude. That's true, but there was a lot of Christmas-related stuff. Maybe that was just the easiest, like, maybe that's just what they thought of whenever they thought of, like, clay animation. Just those old Christmas specials. And here are your choices. Oh, no. <laughs> Don't. Why would you do that? Elisa has a coworker who sits next to her that will, just whenever she needs a break and she needs to kind of like clear her mind, she'll go and she'll watch pimple popping videos. Doctor Pimple Popper. Oh, At work. It's uh, it's bad. Uh, there was also that Gumby knockoff character that was like Taffy. He, his world was a candy level. Yes, I distinctly remember Taffy. I remember him having a bad attitude. I just remember him being a woman. Hey, you guys all got the real thing. <laughs> Hooray, he doesn't even look very happy about his noodle on. I'll take the points. 
<laughs> Excellent drawing as usual, Jake. I'm getting ready to see that shit. Oh, oh Arturo's what's up? here! What's up, Arturo? <laughs> Yeah. Are you in the are you in the stream? You have to find you have to find well, you could do it from there, honestly. Actually, you uh, could you can join the room as an audience member and you could vote. It's true. So, all you have to do is go to jackbox.tv and type in fra. F R A W. <laughs> God, these are all good. Hmm. Okay, who picked what? We found a lot of ways to say pretty much the same thing. <laughs> yeah. uh, <laughs> which is always always a difficult choice when it comes to the voting situation. <laughs> gotcha! Oh yeah? Well, I got you! Yeah, you did. And we got each other. It's alright, we just give each other points. Jake got got. Or, or got, got you. By getting it right. We, we really did. We named it pretty much the same thing. Oh no. Shit, how did I do this? Okay. He does have a sack. Okay, I did my very best. This was a difficult one, so good luck. Yeah. <laughs> it gave me one that, like, unless I was a, a very good finger drawing person, indeed, I uh, would have no way of doing. So, here we go. So how's World of Light, Sean? Uh, you know, it's going on forever. I'm having a good time with it. How far are you? I'm um, in the second half of it? <laughs> Probably not half. The second air. Oh no! Jake got erased. Do your best. Just believe in yourself. <laughs> Quickly, Jake. <laughs> oh no. Started too late. I got something in there. Let's do another one. Uh, but yeah, I'm doing okay with it. I'm I'm enjoying it. I'm doing that a lot more than I am just like classic. Mode. Yeah, same here. I I like kind of fooling with the spirits and stuff. Sorry, we're, we're just, we're just, we're all naming this beautiful drawing. Uh huh. Type in anything. Ooh. Were they pretty cool? 
how many of them were black light? Ooh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nice SpongeBob reference, whoever wrote that. Uh, Jake, the reason you can only hear Sean and I is because I think Sean was the only one that uh, joined my thing officially or whatever. Whoa, really? Yeah. Oh no, that's weird. Alright, let's see. Sol is it solitary confinement? Probably not. Uh, fucking got me, Jake! Let's see, my own private Idaho. That's a dead be <laughs> You can get some cute couple points. <laughs> uh, because Arturo voted for you. Nobody believed that me right now was the true title, but I did get them some thumbs up, so I'll take it. Oh my Christ. <laughs> huh. All right. Got some theories about this. Guess a good ten seconds. Done. And here are your choices. <laughs> okay, I think we all got the basic idea. <laughs> <laughs> See ya. Huh. Okay, great. We all kind of knew what it was after we ran through our mind. What would there be a thousand of? That looks like that. Nothing. But what's, this <laughs> what's the thing that's closest to it? Probably puzzle pieces. Problem is... We kind of all got it, so, yeah, all right. Ian gets some more points from Arturo. Damn. It was not a lot of puzzle pieces. Thank you for the points. I've just never seen a number in one of these answers or whatever. It makes sense. <laughs> it was a very informative drawing. That being said, if I ever saw a bunch... Actually, you know what? If I saw a puzzle that was made out of puzzle pieces that looked like that, I would absolutely get that puzzle. Because it would be like... There would be some complicated pieces of pieces, a, a, a puzzle in there. <laughs> what is this? Okay, gonna put what I gen genuinely think this is. Yum. Mm-hmm. 
And then you know what? Just all good answers across the board. It bothers me that one of these is correct. <laughs> you mean it's not fingering it? me what's cat food? My cat's wet food? Yay! I got you, Kylie! I did want that to be true. Yeah, I did vote for that one just because that's the one I wanted it to be. It can't just be lard. <laughs> Holy shit, it's just lard! That's boring. What is that? What's that beautiful thing in the top left corner? Fingers. Type in a convincing title now. No, okay, so that is what I thought it was. Did someone just cheat? Well, when you see what this actually was, you, like, I had no choice. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> just have fun with it, you know? Just, just have fun. It's a game. God damn it! I didn't have time. And here are your choices. <laughs> Were you writing a short uh, missive to me about not using words? Uh -huh. <laughs> oh no! Those are too oh, no. dirty. On an under the bread, <laughs> under the bed snack break. <laughs> Although I would, I believe you. I mean, yay! Points. Yeah, how the fuck do you draw Tom Hanks under a bed without worse? That was not played by Tom Hanks. That was played by a beautiful uh, ball actor. Oh my god. We, uh, we kind of got the basic idea, huh?
the fuck was his answer? Congratulations. New players. All right, Arturo, hop on in. Oh, I, I, I had to make a new thing to include you. It's D I S G. <laughs> I guess that's everybody, huh? <laughs> oh yeah, you missed that whole conversation. Now that I've got all your drawings, it's time for 
some fun. Use your devices to type in what you think the real title for this picture could have been. Jake, we're all here. We're just concentrating on this drawing. Here are your choices. Try to pick the real title and avoid all the garbage everyone else typed in. Hey, can you guys hear me? Uh, I can hear you now. Okay. Uh, I think maybe my mic has just been off for a little while there. <laughs> okay, let's, let's see here. Oh no. Shaving zits off a leg. Don't. <laughs> you know, I bet John has very shapely calves. Yay, looks like we kinda all got it. After a bit. It's true, it was a little difficult to tell. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I like how much, like, there's a lot of effort went into this one, <laughs> lots of layers. Is it sad that I found out that nobody could hear me uh, after I moved my uh, microphone to my butt so I could fart into it and no one reacted? And I'm like, there must be a problem. <laughs> now we were just ignoring you. <laughs> just gonna encourage him. He'll just fart into his microphone again and then we'll all have to smell it. If you have synesthesia, it's very bad. <laughs> well, this is a great round for answers. <laughs> Yay! I've uh, got who who do I not give a check to this <laughs> Uh-huh. No. Ian gotcha, Jake. Was it meat fight? It was not meat fight. I take your points, Kylie. Was it T Bone Battle, perhaps? It was not Hot John Goddess. <laughs> no, does those does those look like T bones to you? Was it B fight? It was B fight. It was B fight. 
It that was, was a good one, though. Drawing. <laughs> I would I like get that on a t-shirt. An existential crisis is both reaching like, and great. I, I really like the stakes are higher. I've never yes. been higher. Another excellent, excellent name. Oh no! This is just a gross drawing, no matter how you slice it. Get your head out the gutter. How the fuck do you... Look at that drawing! <laughs> no part of that looks, looks pleasant for the bird! Hurry up, people! Just type something in! Jake, I do love that drawing of that snowman. <laughs> It reminds me of the... Remember the drawing of the wizard he did? Here are your choices. I can only remember that great drawing of that guy partying and throwing up at the same time. <laughs> yeah, they... <laughs> I remember that. We did that one with... with uh... Jeff Gill. Uh, Jeff Gill. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Just like welcome to Stink Town. <laughs> There's no way that's the correct answer, but I do love it. And how? Ian fucking got us. Tyler got our churro. Fucking got him. Was it just wet bird? Yep. What a what a wonderful drawing for a boring prompt. I know. Right? Type in a title now. <laughs> By the way, John, uh, water does not stick to animals like cum sticks to <laughs> sticks to bed. Geez. How do you represent a wet bird then? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, I, I've got to do some math to figure out this particular... Hmm... Hmm... <laughs> Everybody laughing. Just farce. And here are your choices. There's a lot of math you gotta do for this one. Okay. Someone just didn't, didn't try too hard. Hmm. Mm-hmm. 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 No, oh, no. I'm real excited to figure out what the fuck that thing on the right is supposed to be. Because I thought it was supposed to be like a weird slice of pizza. Yeah, I, I thought it was like me. like that that, that old-fashioned like elementary school pizza. Typical British lunch. Fucking goddess, John. Boom. You've been fooled. British food. Yeah, all right. I know, I, see, the problem was, it was just, like, it was a delightful and perhaps a little confusing drawing for a pretty plain prompt. John fucking got us all. This whole thing was to rag on the British, and I can get behind that. Hmm. I don't know what the fuck this is.
And here are your choices. <laughs> we all kind of got the got the gist. Arguably, it was too clear. This drawing is too good. Ian gotcha. He did. <laughs> Kylie, I wish it was this baby. He's got $10. Another plain prompt, but you know what? Beautifully executed. I will give those points to that beautiful snowman any day. Type in a title now. While you guys think about that, my screen says, you drew this. Have you ever considered that you might be the only person in the universe and everything else, everyone, everything is just in your mind? Have you? This game's deep. So thanks, Jackbox.tv. <laughs> is what is somebody in this group calls every bank a non spank bank? Is it your local courthouse? It is not. Kelly got you. Is it? The weight of capitalism. It is not, Jake. You fucking got got. Is it too big to fail? No, you guys have a lot of opinions on banks. Is it Greek bank? Yes, it is, John. I... I, yeah, maybe I could have thought of some other things to go on around. I thought the I beautiful ionic columns would uh, would give it away. Perhaps I should have gone with Corinthian. Hmm. <laughs> How do I draw this? Well, <laughs> I do not have high hopes for this particular drawing, but here we go. 
I like that we keep gaining a viewer and then losing a viewer. Sorry we're not being entertaining enough for you uh, uh, streaming public. Good luck, everyone. <laughs> That's the spirit. Hurry up, Arturo. Got your drawings. Some of them are uh, trying to make it perfect. I want to see all those beautiful layers come in. <laughs> hey, good luck. <laughs> Very nice. Take very, everyone very long to pick that one. Jay got you, Kylie. <laughs> it was not the electric Kool Aid acid death. Was it tripping out? No, fucking Kylie got you. Is it acid tongue? Yes. Pretty good. Lots of very informative arrows in this one. Yay! I'm glad everyone liked. I can't believe I ate a very small turd. Well, yeah. <laughs> I look forward to seeing your interpretation. These are all good! Skull spying on the baby again is definitely my favorite. Wow, holy fuck, I cannot believe that everyone got the gist of it. I basically gave up after I, I started to draw <laughs> a pirate a, a pirate flag, and I'm like, wait, that's not a symbol for death, that's a symbol for pirates. So I had to cover it up with that cool brown line. Uh, they're double in this round. Huh. Hmm. Hmm, yes. 
Huh. Hmm. Only got five seconds. Oh my god! There's a lot. There's a lot of shit going on in this drawing, John. You can't. You gotta give people the full time. <laughs> Just nope, huh? Yeah, I don't think anybody's gonna get this. Sorry. <laughs> and here are your A lot. These are very different answers. If it's sitting, period, eating shirt, period, happy, period, I, I just don't know what to tell you. Ah, oh, that one just seems so out of left field. I had to guess. Nope. Now, uh, now I'm just curious. Was it Gingerbread Man? It was not Gingerbread Man. Was it sitting eating shirt happy? What the fuck? <laughs> yeah. Why are there X's? That Why was the house? Okay, so this is. <laughs> I got the eating shirt part down, but then I realized, oh shit, he's supposed to be sitting. So I tried to draw yeah, sofa. And then you... <laughs> ah, oh, that's what that is, definitely. Uh huh. Now what is this? Very good. Neil, <laughs> 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 <Not just anyone. laughs> <laughs> <Neal, laughs> the pro vaccination teddy bear. <laughs> These are all good answers. Was it about to mainline this, honey? No, but Kylie, congratulations on the greatest answer of this particular round. Teddy bear breaks bad. Fucking got me, hot John. That's right. Was it just evil teddy bear? It was. Wow, that's... So what's the needle that's... for? That's some high <laughs> shit. Oh, my Jesus, friend. Jake. <laughs>
I just love this drawing. I like looking at it. <laughs> Boone peace. Like, he's having a good time. Boone's <laughs> having a good time. Those sperms on their way to the moon are all having a good time. <laughs> Spy Fox. Allegory. Ooh. If that was a real prompt, if the word allegory appeared on my fucking screen, I, I might have a stroke. I don't know what my brain would do to try to put that into a visual language. A proper werewolf? Mmm. Is it a black tie, a black tie werewolf affair? No, John fucking got it. Boop. <laughs> Was it fancy Wolverine? Holy shit! <laughs> Jake's uh, Wolverines aren't created by the moon. <laughs> <laughs> did you see? Did you see Wolverine and think that it was werewolf? Oh, you silly Billy. Mmm. Mm hmm. I truly don't know what which one of these wonderful answers the game could have potentially <laughs> thought was a good thing to make people draw. I really want it to be money shot. Please. <laughs> oh. oh man. I mean I knew it wasn't, but I really wanted it to be. It was not Money Man cleans up his <laughs> No, it couldn't possibly. No, fancy so. It does. I just didn't want it to be fancy. So. Ooh, that was a I close it to one. Be money shot. John's the wiener, but who is who's the secret winner? Who's the? Who's the... Oh, oh, it's also John. God damn it! All right, we'll just have to be funnier next time. I'm down for one more. It's only 11 o'clock. Yeah. I, I'm, I'm, uh, I'm about to, to be done as well. My brain is completely spent. Okay, uh, well, we can pick this up another time. Yeah. Well, alright. Well, love you guys. Uh, we should do this, obviously. Well... So I'm going to be at home next weekend. Uh, I, I would like to play, like, I'll be able to play, like, Smash and shit like that. But uh, Ian, by the way, at some point, I still have Windjammers on my PlayStation because it, it, it takes up, like, two kilobytes. Uh, if you ever want to play Windjammers with somebody, just let me know because I'd like to play more Windjammers. <laughs> Oh, guess what? That's that's getting a physical release on the Switch. Oh yeah, I saw that. Those guys have made a lot of money from uh, releasing it on the on the PlayStation and on other consoles. It's pretty cool. It's also by that uh, Limited Run Games that's doing the uh, Celeste physical release. Nice. They put out good work. All right, kids. I got it too. 
All right, see you later, Sean. Have you later. Good night. Bye. I guess I'll shut this thing down. Bye, Jake. I didn't see anything. <laughs>